Hey guys, welcome back to this video. That's the video of the Logan Paul Brothers roasting me. Roast is why. Yeah, I roast people, but there's Q and A's, there's challenges, there's vlogs, there's music videos. Like I do other stuff. Call me out for being a bully and a terrible person. And he proceeds to say, "You're making fun of something that could be out of someone's control, and everyone should feel comfortable in their own bodies, and everyone can look however the f they want." I agree. That is a very, very good point. But how are you gonna just say that? When you've done... Yes, <laughs> where are you from? I'm from Kazakhstan originally, but... Oh. It sounds like you're just gonna blow someone up. You're like, send the nuke! He has a fan where he send the from. nuke! He uh. answer. He makes a bomb joke. Not only was he born there, and it's something that he can't Damn, even control, but... Joke. Dude, that's racist! Oh. <laughs> that's are you good? Because you laugh like a walrus all the time. It's annoying. <laughs> Okay, not only was that kind of mean, but like that's something that she can't control. You just burst out laughing sometimes, and she was born with that laugh. And to top it all off, every time she laughs, starting now, in the back of her head, she's like, damn, should I laugh? You know, not too loud, because I might sound like a lot. She's going to be insecure and just kind of ashamed of her laugh. Can't you make it out with her monthly hair Okay, so if you're confused, Weird. check out this picture. It kind of looks like Jake is just telling the kid what to say. And by the editing, I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Jake was really out in these streets talking to the kid like, Okay, okay, say chance. Chance. Okay, good. Now say still. Still. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, making out. Making out. Perfect, perfect. Okay, with his ugly. Make sure you say ugly. With his ugly? Okay, last one. Girlfriend. Girlfriend. And so all he needs to do now is get his editor to chop it up and make it good. But wait, wait. Let's pop it all off and just put some towers just so she knows she's a, a little kid saying something savage. Yeah, it's funny. Ha ha ha. But then again, you're calling her ugly. That is her. That is issue. Very serious. Logan and I are your dads. We gave birth to you. Okay, I thought my dad was Asian. Wow. Logan, my grandfather, because he made your career. So I want to thank Logan. I just made my adopted. I, I just don't understand. The point I was trying to wow. make notorious this year. And then next year, when someone more viral and more annoying than you pops up, I'll be the first one to make a video about it. And then I'm bouncing. Success. Success. But in your video, you started comparing us. You started saying that, oh, our house is this, your house is that. Don't ever compare me to your sorry ass. All right, man, he has a point, you know. Just because our house are, you know, in the same level of coolness, they're... Lots of beautiful characters. Lots of memories, even though we don't know. I don't know. Steak. Steak. Friend. <laughs> The same. Perhaps it was unfair of me to put so much pressure on you as I did. After in a Disney show, so for him to say we can't compare each other, he has a point and he low key roasted. But then after saying don't compare us, he proceeds to compare us. I bought this house with my own damn money. You're paying rent for one room. Congrats on your house. Uh, it looks like something I would want to raise a family in. But as of now, I need a place where I can trap out of. And you know, buying a house is such a big commitment, and I. Can't Compare me to your sorry ass. Dude, relax. Like, is it really that serious? I was just curious. This dude's over here, like, spitting and shit. Anyways, he just keeps going on. I'm a Disney Channel star. I've done Fox movies, YouTube Red movies. I have my own YouTube Red show. My page has 3 billion views. I've been doing this for one year. Okay. Rewind three years back. You were already actively trying on YouTube and posting vlogs. Stop that. <laughs> Uh, he wasn't ready. I've been doing this for one year. <laughs> Them two, so I think Chloe got very jealous that I got in there with Manny. I think she even swilled us. Yes, I did swill Abby, but I need to show her who was boss of the lesbians. Me and Marnie are girlfriends, so Abby needs to find her own girlfriend. I was just joking, swilling Abby, but I was showing her who was boss. I'm not very happy about it. To be fair, me and Chloe have drifted a lot and we're finally getting back to the place that we used to be and we're finally kissing again. Basically, we're girlfriends again. So I can understand why she's getting jealous because she doesn't want us to cheat on her with Abby. I actually couldn't believe it myself. And they've all said, when you neck on with Marnie, that's when you know you're a proper family member. Who knows, it might happen again. Yeah. I have one shoe. I don't know what the... Okay.
Two thousand likes as well. I came up, so let's clarify. I went from nothing to transferred your fan base who already built to YouTube. So for you to make it seem this whole video has been consistent. Clout gang. Since when was started? Clout gang. This is a form of group. Your idea. I don't know who the first or side man. David Dobrik's crew. Like the list goes on. The only thing that separates Team Ten from all these other groups is you guys just have more fans. That's it. You guys are doing the same exact formula. There's a proven formula to work, and it just makes making content a lot easier. Make growing a lot easier. You guys are all sharing fans. You guys are all collaborating. But the thing is, you claim that Team Ten is like one big happy family when Alyssa used to be in Team Ten, and she told me everyone in Team Ten hates you. They despise you. They're just around you to get their followers. Cloud Gang is all my friends. I'm living in a house with my friends. There's no leader. There's no head boss. No one takes orders from anyone. Me and Banks had a vision, so that's why we started up Cloud Gang, but we're not leaders. We're not above anyone. Like, we're all equals. We're all friends. Alyssa told me what Team 10 meant. You actually even said this in an interview, but it used to be named 10 Digit Entertainment or something like that. 10 Digit Media, some random stuff. They switched it over to Team 10. The 10 in Team 10 represents 10 digits, and there's 10 digits in $1 billion. And the main goal is for Jake's company, Team 10, to be worth $1 billion. Million dollar one day. Seems like all he cares about is money. He's doing all this team stuff just for the money, which is okay because that's his life. I mean, that's his business life. I like money too. But don't say we copy you. I love money too. The first one to do it. Us. It is now in a good solely off of. I'm not sure if you guys noticed. Oh no, guys, Jake Paul. That won't get me anywhere. He really tries to like. He's trying to make everyone turn against me. You guys need to change your mindset, or you're gonna live your life just being filled with hatred. Why is this guy telling my fans what to do? He's not saying like, yo, you guys should, you know, change your mindset of life. He is literally saying you need to change your mindset of life, or you will be filled with hatred. If you are wearing his merch, that means you support all of this negativity and all that bad stuff, which makes you not cool in my book. Once again, if you guys wear my merch, it's not because you guys. 